Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, I want to express my great gratitude to all of the wonderful people who not only tolerate the show, survive the show, participate in the show, but even those people who actually like it. And I understand that there are those people who like the show and go outside to experience it away from the show because they they like it so much that... I love you, son. Yeah, thank you, thank you. It wasn't pointing about you. <laughs> She's looking very nice in that dress. Stop it. You in the words. Yes, oh, thank you, Brian. Keep me on target. Thank you, my friend. Reverend Marshall, thank you for coming in. Even Granny, who swore she would never set foot in the bar, has returned to the tabernacle. Amen. Granny? Amen. The second coming of Granny. The second coming of Granny. Yes, there's something to that, I think. We've attracted the interest of the alien motherhood who now resides in the Sun Center restrooms. Um, no longer the alligator. Yeah, no longer the alligator. So we purified the alligator. Now we've got to work on these restrooms. But anyway, and we have tried to cleanse them in the power of the Holy Spirit. We went right in there with sponges and <laughs> chemicals and to no avail. But maybe with the alien motherhood, we can come to some arrangement and work things out so long as they do not continue their reverse engineering of UFOs in an effort to take over the population of Gainesville, Florida to do their un un unworthy deeds. Um, ladies and gentlemen, at this time, uh, besides thanking you so much and thanking you for tolerating and putting up with all of my complete and utter nonsense that you have to face each and every day. Uh, how's my tab doing, by the way, speaking of nonsense? Because it's not like I have to get up at 4 in the morning and go to Mexico or anything. I don't see why I can't have another drink. <sighs> Jesus made wine. I might have wine, maybe. That's medicinal demon alcohol. Yeah, medicinal. Right? It just weans you into the spirit. The calculator doesn't go that high. Yes, yes. <laughs> you know, actually, thank you for coming, I want to say. And uh, yeah, I wonder, I wonder, Michael, would you, would you um, consider waiting a moment so that we can have some music because we've done a lot of talking we've done a lot of spirituality yes and uh okay let's get the priorities straight the drinking the drinking and then the music and then michael garvin will tell us what he's wearing and give us a little insight into easter and more and i want to tell you this don't go away because there is a contest and i can tell you what it is or how you win but you could walk out of here with a surprise I'll leave it there. Spencer is in the house. Give him a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm sorry, I don't want to. Do you have a stage name, or it's, or shall I call you? Susie. Just Susie. Yeah. Susie has one of the greatest instruments ever made by mankind. You would know that if you ever saw the jerk with Steve Martin and heard that beautiful song he played on the beach to Bernadette Peters. Uh, and also the, I'm picking out a thermos for you, not an ordinary thermos will do, but the very best thermos you can buy. Thank you. A round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, music at the Tabernacle Theater.